What's Aldi's? The rapidly growing discount retailer Aldi boasts of its superior store brand products, which are advertised to be as good, if not better, than the name brand. I'm here to test that claim by buying, comparing, and reviewing products from both Aldi and the name brand, all in an attempt to save you money and bring this information to you in full circle. Good evening, you two. Full circle review back here again with another review. This time I have General Mills Cocoa Puffs versus Millville's by Aldi's Chocolate Puffs. So Cocoa Puffs, naturally flavored frosted corn puffs. Cuckoo for cocoa, chocolatey milk. And then chocolate puffs made with real cocoa. Sweetened corn cereal, natural flavor with other natural flavors. So you got some type of bird versus a chipmunk. I prefer the chipmunk. If you would like to see nutritional information, please hit the Instagram link in the description to be taken to a high-resolution photo of the nutritional information. Um, so for General Mills, dive into more chocolatey fun. When Coca-Cola Puffs splash down into your bowl, it turns the milk into an extra slurp alicious treat. Can you help Sonny spot the slide that leads to a delicious chocolatey milk dip? Then ride down the tubes to find six hidden words that fill in the blanks in the name of this sweet attraction. My word. They were not this complex with these puzzles when I was a kid. My word. And then, um, Aldi's has like an educational word find. Growing up, I don't think we ever really had Cocoa Puffs. I feel like sometimes we had Cocoa Pebbles. But never Cocoa Puffs. I didn't really have much say in the cereal that we bought. And now this is a corn-based cereal, and I, I prefer corn-based cereal, but we'll just see how the flavor profile holds up. There it is. I taste the corn. It's sweet, but I don't really get any chocolate. Let's try a little bit of milk. I hear, reading on the box, that this is supposed to turn the milk chocolatey. We're going to find out. It's, it's, it's going to an off-brown. Anyway, let's try it. Milk helps. It just tastes like sweet corn. I don't really get any chocolate. And the milk is not really that chocolatey. Uh, this is disappointing. Mainly a sweet corn puff cereal. Accented with cocoa. I mean, it's like a very weak hot chocolate. Maybe. I don't get any chocolate at all. Uh, 62 out of 100. They can improve by making the chocolate a lot stronger. I like the texture and consistency of the cereal itself. Maybe cut it back on the corn flavoring so much. That corn's very strong. I think the sweetness is just about right for a cereal here. They definitely need to increase the coating on these so that your milk really turns chocolatey. This is disappointing. So let's try the Millville. Yeah, these are much darker. High hopes. High hopes. These are softer. 
Still crispy. But I get some cocoa. Try with a splash of milk. There we go. Yeah, it looks like it's going to turn the milk as chocolatey as the Cocoa Puffs. Let's see how they fare. I get the cocoa flavor. That's much better. It's not super really sweet. I like this. It's a almost like an adult cereal in my opinion. It's not super sweet. It's not super candy chocolatey. It tastes like a good, almost like a baked chocolate cake cocoa. Texture is a little bit softer than the cocoa puff, so it's not so abrasive on your mouth. Understand, it's not a chocolate cereal, it's a cocoa cereal. Yeah, these are much better than Cocoa Puffs. 82 out of 100, they can improve by making the cocoa a little bit stronger. I would like it to be a darker cocoa. What they have here is almost like a light, just regular chocolate cake cocoa. I'd like, like a devil's food chocolate cake cocoa. I also feel like they could scale it back on the corn flavoring. This is like super corn heavy, but uh, still outstanding cereal. Needs more coating so the milk becomes more chocolatey. Other than that, this is great. I'd buy this definitely over Cocoa Puffs. As we've said, all these cereal reviews, more videos like this, comment down below and I'll keep them coming.